Today, Art Media brings you at modo.com. It is a new social learning phrase in Swiss Cottage. The geography teachers are using them, the history teachers are using them, possibly the literature and the English teachers are using them too. Why not art? Yes, the art teacher and his student are going to use at modo.com. Here is how it works. Go to the at modo.com site and choose your role. Psst, I have two accounts. First account is to be fulfilled by my role as a teacher and my student account to be a spy inside the class group. Only my student account is fake but it is secure. Students need to have a group code to access to their classes. Okay. Yes, it looks like Facebook but it was designed as such so that students will intuitively understand the whole interface. Okay now, let's have a look at my art classes. Students are looking into the pop art movement for this lesson. What would be a greater art textbook for these grade 8 students than the internet itself? Anyway, I have two assignments in the social learning platform. To check attendance, I have designed a simple assignment to just post a favorite pop art furniture. Secondly, it gets more and more complex whereby students are required to put up a pop art artwork and explain the artwork and also its relevance with the society at that period of time. Done! 1 hour 20 minutes. Pure research and myself shaking my legs, reading newspaper and drink coffee. Of course not! I will comment on every student who, who turn in their assignment to get a more in-depth answer from them. If you have a class, try it. The possibilities of using such tools are endless. Web 2.0 brings education for students anywhere and anytime. Once we have this in place, you will never need to worry about what they are doing on the web. By the way, I'm still waiting for my name portal to get approved. Art Media